Hi people, uh, and welcome back to the adventures of Odo and Jill Sandwich. <coughs> <laughs> oh, not gonna let that go. No. <laughs> so this is part two of Resident Evil. This is part two of the unwinnable situation. Well, we'll find out if it's unwinnable or not. You know, never count your chickens until they've hatched, and all that jazz. So, what I'm trying to remember what happened last time. Not a whole lot, really. It's mostly cutscenes. It was mostly cutscenes. Um, that zombie fell over due to lack of adequate bath mats in the bathroom. Um, this zombie down here ate my face because I was too busy texting you. Um, it is fine. Oh, oh, zombies! Okay. I don't know what it would be like when it gets published, but I could barely see that thing. Oh, there's another one. Oh, God. Oh, it's your brain. And that's another dagger gone. Wow, you're really having some trouble there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm not going to lie. Bad things tend to happen on this one. So, Apple released their new iPhone 6, didn't they? I have not seen this. Yeah, they, yeah, they released it uh, late last night or early this morning for UK people. Oh, sweet. There's like two versions, iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus, I think. Yep, uh, yep, yep, check this out. Oh! Yep. Yeah. It, it totally went badly. Good, good thing zombie disease isn't infectious. Oh, wait. Oh, my yep, yep. god. Yeah, that totally happened. You totally got killed. It's okay, I was just testing. Uh, oh, oh wait, yeah, I'm totally playing the real game and I don't have save states. Oh. So that happened. So now yeah. So now you get a lovely shot of the reload screen. <laughs> Yay! Nostalgia! Now we just gotta wait for... Fear can't kill you, but being shit at this game can. <laughs> <laughs> at least we haven't had the scariest thing of all in terms of video games. Save file data corrupt. Oh. Yeah. The minute we have that, that's it. We should all just run away and hide. But yeah, the iPhone 6 Plus is, I think it's retailing for like £900. Oh, sweet. Yeah, a little bit pricey. Uh, well, it's seeing how I'm still stuck with the iPhone 4S, so, you know. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll just move up to a 5. Yeah, well, you'd have to be a 5S or 5C. Don't do the fives now. Oh really? Yeah, they scrap them. Arse. But the five C's cheap enough. I mean, that's what I've got. See, so. and it works. See, look, I totally do better at this bit as well. Yeah, that's his head gone. Yeah, no burning that guy. Oh god, he's. There we go. He's enough lead in him to make him a roof. Oh, there he's back up. There he's down again. Who's paying the electrical bill as well? Not to mention cleaning the floors and sorting the candles out. Umbrella. Oh, yeah. Keep forgetting about that. Dex. M multi million dollar corporation, you know. Multi billion, I reckon. You know, yeah. they're into weapons. Pharmaceuticals, they're into makeup and shit. Yeah, that's the guy's the good. <laughs> I <laughs> got this, I remember how this, last, this went last time. <laughs> <laughs> so they, they pay for all the electrics and all the candles and all the cleaning, yet they don't change the wallpaper. They need to sort their priorities out. Ah. Uh. They could like pay for Gok One to come in and sort this place out. <laughs> Just come in and. Those drapes are a train wreck! That's really bad stereotypical homosexual voice. <laughs> oh. I do approve of a chessboard. Dog whistle. Because that would be useful. Oh, it's going so fast. I know. No one I can read. I, I totally forgot that people might actually want to read this, and I'm like, oh shit, I better go back. Yeah. <laughs> Mostly because I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing either. Oh, marvellous. 
So I might as well read it too. I'm just kind of scanning. I get from the last one I got balcony and terrace. Yep. And Spencer. It's fine, it's not a game you need to read instructions at all. Nah, I didn't bother reading the botany one, I'm pretty sure everyone knows how to use uh, herbs in this one. Oh yeah. That's a lot of picture frames as well. Someone has issues. And I totally set myself on fire! Ah, oh, genius! Yeah. You're like a monk protesting against extremists. Just sit down, pour petrol over yourself and set yourself on fire. They do that. They, Did they? Yeah, they still do it now. I think the first recorded one was like in the Vietnam War. Some monk was like, No, don't do this. And the way I'm going to get you to not do it, I'm going to set myself on fire. What was it like? Don't napalm. Look, watch. Look what happens. It hurts. Fire hurts. See? <laughs> See? Look how it hurts me. Uh, this was a bad idea from the start, wasn't it? I'm not sure how well this plan was fought through. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Hindsight. Oh, fireplace. Yeah, Talking of fire. and I totally forgot to pick up the piece of board that was in the other room, so I have to go back. <laughs> it's locked. Oh no. Some really jazzy doors in this game. This game does make you appreciate the hard work that goes into doors. Some good doors. Mm. You know, actual solid wooden doors and like the hollow things filled with cardboard that you get nowadays. They are actually filled with cardboard. While I was at university, we smashed one of our friend's bathroom doors down, and inside it was filled with cardboard. It's like, really? Look, I totally didn't set myself on fire that time. Well, that's a plus. Progress! Yeah! Getting better! All we need now is a training montage. <clears throat> Gotta have a montage. Do, do, do. Back to the same room. I'd like to go and get some more petrol. <laughs> Sorry, kerosene. Green. Ah, you don't. You, you, you might notice that I have one in the chamber and then two in the clip. <laughs> 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 might as well take the shotgun. Yeah, I mean those three rounds aren't going to do a lot of good. N nah, not when it takes about ten to take down a zombie. Yeah. To hit them in the head, it's mostly Wheel of Fortune to actually get them in the head. Yeah, I mean, I, I took that guy out that was up here twice. Yeah. For a shot to the head. And the other guy, you, no, didn't you just get him straight off? I thought it was like one shot. No, I, I, I put about three into him. I think the third one hit him in the head. Ah, okay. I have to come down these corridors a lot. Yeah. I think I might as well clear them. Wait for your own good. Because uh, people who know the game know why you're doing that. Yeah. Yeah. Fuckers. But we won't. We won't spoil. Do any of them appear? Oh yeah. Oh joy. In this episode. In ah. Oh. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. Oh, so maybe I had more shots. Maybe it was seven I had in the, uh, the gun. Oh, okay. Really small picture, I can't see. <laughs> yeah. It's a problem with some games, you just can't see writing. Oh, now I have one in the uh, chamber. <laughs> <laughs> Save that last one for you, Jill. <laughs> Gonna need it. Yeah, for your for yourself. Bring it on the point that it's uh well 
Suicide Prevention Day today as well. And yeah, that's a thing. Yeah. So, people, if you're listening and you feel a bit down in the dumps, cheer up. It's all good and such other things. In another life, I was a motivational speaker. Clearly, you weren't fucking good at it. Wow. It was another life, so. Ah, oh, that's true. I died from something. Probably a panda. Mauled to death by a panda. Do you know that lemmings don't actually commit suicide and that was brought on by Walt Disney? Oh, yeah. But I did spout a few good games out of it. Yeah, that's true. Is it, they were made by the creators of Worms, weren't they? Uh, Lemmings games? Or at least a couple of them. I don't know. I can't say that I remember much of Lemmings games. I didn't really like them wholly. Oh. And I haven't played them since the Mega Drive. Oh. Well. It was a while ago. <laughs> I like Worms games. Worms They're good. games are amazing. Can't really say a bad word against them. It's like the PC ones, you could change the voices. Yeah, I and mean, you can on uh, these 360 versions, you can have different voices. Oh, you can change what voices they are on every one of them, but you can actually add voices in on the uh, PC version. Oh, so you can like record your own stuff? Yeah, I had a Robocop one, that was cool. Yeah. Brilliant. Every time it went to fire, it would do the Ed 209 thing. <laughs> have five seconds to comply. <laughs> <laughs> I and mean, then you just don't listen and kill anyway. Yeah. I also changed it to the guy that's in the uh, supermarket that's like, fuck you, fuck <laughs> you, fuck you. <laughs> I haven't seen a new Robocop actually. Uh, it's not bad. Okay. It's not as good as the original though. Well, no, it's kind of hard for it to be as good as the original. Yeah. Um, I'll give it a watch at some point. Barry. Oh no! Jill. It's going to turn into so a puddle. The worst part is that he pulls the gun on her. <laughs> She's like, Barry! Oh shit! <laughs> yeah, because we've he heard these things talk before. Yeah. <clears throat> you can get his gun on this game, can't you? Yeah, I believe uh, this. You have to play through multiple times, but. Yeah. It's yours. Hopefully, you won't have to use it. Cheers, Odo. Can I have the uh, gun to go with it as well, please? <laughs> yeah, that'd be an idea. What about you know, you? as good as I think it would actually do smacking him around the head with a uh, ammo can. Um, blunt, blunt force. I'll take it. Work. Ciao. I'll soon have the gun. Ciao. He doesn't need a gun anyway, he'll just turn into a puddle. <laughs> oh, he doesn't need a gun. Exactly. There's that it's dodgy controller coming into play again. Oh, the dodgy controller comes into play a lot in this <laughs> one. And, and this is the part where I scare the crap out of myself by running past the window with a reflection! Oh! <laughs> and I'm like... Yeah, I just saw that. And I'm like, oh wait, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, ooh, reflection! Yeah, that's... Oh, God. See, a game in it as early as this can do reflections, dynamic lighting, you know. I, see, I, I got my PS4 yesterday, um, mm. and I was playing uh, Destiny, um, and to be fair, I went in it with no hopes whatsoever for the game, um, yeah. and it wasn't that bad, actually. It's a little bit Borderlands Call of Duty Halo, um, <laughs> but, you know, it's it's okay, I'm enjoying it. I'm only at like, level 3, so I don't really have a you know great deal of time in the game, but it's kind of cool. Uh, like yeah. the changing of the characters and stuff, um, but as I part like right at the beginning where you're like running through this like I want to say dam, mm. um, and it's all really dark and stuff, and you get into like the air system, and there's like this fan going around, and I'm like, yeah, that's that's not too bad, and then you get closer to it, and it's like, oh, that looks shit. It's oh. just like these like black beams of like pure blackness just going around constantly on the the walls, Brilliant. and I'm just like. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> it's like Resident Evil did it really well. Yeah, I I, I know the mission you're talking of because I uh, played the beta and that was that's like the first introductory. Thing yeah. It's like 
the little, well, it's basically 343 Guilty Spark, that little yeah. drone thing. And he's like, oh, run away, hide, and then fight. I want to hide, here's a gun. Now shoot. What class did you go for? A uh, warlock. Ah, uh, that's exactly what I went for in the beta. I like that, it's, it's cool. <coughs> I've, I've just unlocked the ability to um to glide as well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. But, yeah, we won't call it Destiny, we'll just call it Call of... Call of Halo Borderlands. Call of Border Halo. Call of Border Halo. Um. <laughs> and that's what it is. But yeah, I mean, it, it literally screams of Borderlands. It's just yeah. like, this is almost identical in every way. Um, mm. And then the characters are Halo. <coughs> Yeah. And the weapons handle like Call of Duty. Which, to be fair, isn't a bad thing. Cause no. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh, it's, oh. A, it's a doggy. Oh. I shall call him Terence. Fuck you, Terence. That's for shitting on the carpet. Fucking dogs. Oh my god. Better you playing it than me, because I would have literally just thrown the controller and run away and gone into the kitchen and eaten a whole tub of Ben and Jerry's. It's too real, man. It's too real. <laughs> it's too real. Oh man, I'm, I'm so glad you have to burn the fucking dogs in this game. Oh, imagine those. That's what you should do back. with it, the new remake. You should make the dogs come back as well. No. It'd be hilarious. No. No, don't give them ideas. The bastards enough. Shotgun rounds did you have? Uh, I had 11 in the gun to begin with. And you used 3, I think? I think it was 3. Yeah. You just killed one straight off and then the other one took. Yeah, it was two. really weird that one. I just, like, shot forward and he kind of died at the side of me. Yeah. Ooh, colour. Yep. Just in case you and Odo decide to get a bit kinky. <laughs> get Odo to wear it. <coughs> Nah, it'd, it'd lose it. It'd just, like, slop under a door and then leave it behind. Ah, uh, that's true. I'll get Jill to wear it. Yeah. We'll make her a personalised one that says, Come slut. <laughs> 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 oh, dear. And then she can drink Odo up through a straw. Oh. That's how he likes it. Oh. He likes to truly be inside a woman. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, I think he went too far. <laughs> and then he <laughs> turns back into a person and wears them as a second skin. <laughs> <laughs> I, I could continue, but I'm not going to. Please shut up now. <laughs> I've just ruined Deep Space Nine for you, haven't I? You have. <laughs> Never going to be able to look at Odo the same. Especially when he starts having that romance with Kira. Oh, God. That's, yeah. It that was weird to begin with and you just made it worse. <laughs> <laughs> well, that might be how they reproduce. No, I believe they just, like, all go into one giant puddle and make a big ocean of changeling people. <laughs> they, get, they all go into, like, a smoothie maker. They get mixed up and then get divided into cups. As part is, I'm almost sure that's the way it works. <laughs> this guy's just stupid, he's facing the wrong way. <laughs> ah, I have three shots left. Fire. Do -do -do. They need to make up their minds on like what sort of lighting they want in the house, so because I've seen candles, flaming torches, and electrical light bulbs. You know, yeah. Make up your mind. To be fair, I think they were just showing off. Because that fire is amazing. Yeah, no, it is yep. brilliant fire. Yeah, no coming back for you. I should get a new head. Yeah, he's just, he's gone. We should take one of those pipes. Uh, he's totally looking in the mirror. <laughs> totally like, I'm a pretty girl. I'm pretty good. <laughs> I look good today. <laughs> that, that was brilliant. Just flew backwards. 
Oh god, he's up again. See, they're the kind of moments that would make me shit my pants. Oh. Yep, hence why I retreated. Yeah, I just saw what he became. Oh, did you realise that was a crimson head? No, no. Yep, that was totally a crimson head. I only noticed when he started, like, half crouching and sprinting. Yep. And that is me totally out of ammo, people. So, we got crimson heads knocking about, and no ammo. Yeah. Marvellous. And crows. Well, no one fed the bird. Dicks. Yeah. Pull the RSPCA. <laughs> Send our umbrella down for animal cruelty. Oh, wow. Have you seen what they've done to the dogs? Oh, that's fine. They're dicks. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure they were dicks before they became zombies. Yeah, this one's not going to go well. I need to get past that guy. It didn't work. <laughs> Have any of the games ever done what the third film did with zombie crows? Zombie crow swarm. <clears throat> um, I don't know whether they were zombies, but yes, they did it in number two, where you um go through one of the corridors and instead of having the dogs break through the hallway, it's loads of crows oh, and Lord. they chase you. Not good. Yeah, it's really good. I know it's never good to uh, link the films to the games. Ever. No, not it consists of Resident Evil. No. I mean, if you if you think of the films as like something completely different and separate, then they're not bad films. Uh, it's debatable. Some of them aren't bad. Just don't think of them as Resident Evil. Just think of them as, I, oh god, zombies and other things. And that's Generic what action movie that seems to never end by Paul W. S. Anderson. Yeah. It's called Any excuse to put your wife in a movie. <laughs> Mila Jovovich's biannual paycheck. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. Oh, I need to do another movie this year. Oh, <laughs> Resident Evil? Fallen so far from the fifth element. Oh. She was good in that. It's mainly because she barely spoke a word of English. The minute a word comes out of her mouth, it's oh, oh, please be quiet. You annoy me. <laughs> I'm randomly searching this kitchen for ammo. Um, there isn't any. I know, might have been making gunpowder soup. <clears throat> the best kind. And cue the creepy music. Yeah. What was it in Lord of War? Um, the main character he mixes up uh, like the cordite from a bullet with cocaine and <laughs> snorts it. It's like. That just sounds like a bad idea from the start. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you stick a match up there afterwards as well. Well, that's... Oh. Maybe. Oh. oh dear. Spooky. Fuck, these bastards can open doors. Oh my. That's yep. the same melty bath man from before. Yep, he's back. He's pissed. <laughs> you interrupted bath time. Exactly. And I totally get stuck on a table and can't see. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to relax in the bath listening to Toto. And that's it. Fucking table. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking controller too. Was it the main complaint I've heard from people about Resident Evil is they don't like the camera angles? Like uh, to be fair, I mean, it. I like them. It's good. It mm. helps the situation. Yeah. Um, obviously, because you know you start to panic when you can't see where your character is. Yeah, and it, it just adds. To oh, it. oh, whoa! Oh, like a pro. I didn't even see him until the lightning struck. And we're back here. Ah, oh, that infernal clock. And shiny floor again. 
you Yep, your favourite hallway. <laughs> the hallway that raises many, many questions. Wesker, where are you? Wesker's busy. He's looking all broody and, you know, <coughs> emo. <laughs> Must wear sunglasses at all times. Must not get natural light in my eyes. I permanently have a coup cut. Do you feel I like um, how they portrayed Wesker in the films? I, I think they did a good job on that part. That's probably the only thing they've done well yeah. in terms of linking the game to the movies. Ah, uh, hey, it could have been worse. It could have been Silent Hill. Uh, yeah. I mean, any film where Sean uh, Bean doesn't die, bastard. I'm instantly suspect of. Shit. The less we talk about those films, the better. Yeah, it's totally backwards as well. It's like, he wrote all the characters as female because he preferred females. That's a little bit weird. Yep. Didn't know that. Yeah, um, and the uh, studio made him put uh, Sean Bean in it and write a character for him because there was too many female characters on it, because pretty much every character was a female. Was it in the uh, a second one, not only have they got Sean Bean, they've also got um, the guy who plays, uh, oh, what's his name? The one who plays Jon Snow in Game of Thrones. But yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You don't like Game of Thrones, though, do you? Um, Controversial. <laughs> Controversial, I'm gonna take flag for. Yeah, I didn't like it. <sighs> Hear that, people. The worst part is everybody's like, that knows me is like, but you're gonna love that. It's, it's, you know, it's fantasy. It's got dwarves in it and it's got axes and swords. And well, it hasn't got dwarves in the traditional, like, in the traditional fantasy traditional sense. sense. It's like got a midget. Uh, Alright, yeah. Fair, fair enough. Um, but, but it's got dragons. It's got dragons. Um, you know, I like dragons. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I just struggled to get into it. Okay, that's fair enough. I see. Um, I'm not gonna say it was crap because I didn't think it was. It just mm. I didn't really enjoy it. Yeah. Was it a series I've been watching? Uh, it's Ban called Banshee. That is an amazing series. Yeah, I, I do need to uh, look into this one. Yeah, worth a watch. And to be fair, whenever I watch anything, it's it's always after it's become popular and died off, so I don't have to deal with people talking about it. Well, um, Banshee isn't really that popular as far as I can tell at the moment. No, it's by the same guys who did True Blood. I mean, I didn't really like True Blood. I didn't even watch it, so I don't know. Yeah, Banshee's good. Yep, I just leave those ink ribbons there. They're not going to be needed. Well, Pretty much not going to survive to be able to save much of Exactly. Yeah. The only person I can see for him is saving them up if you survive and to write your... <laughs> Autobiography. Yeah. Had a nice day. Then I went to a mansion and it all went fucking horrible. Yeah. The title, I'm Fucked, a Jill Valentine story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is totally what this is. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, scared, scared. It's coming down the stairs. I'm out of here. I'm just gonna lock myself in this room and die. Quick, Scarpa! There's a lot of chemicals on this wall. <laughs> <laughs> totally mess myself up with them. Just start huffing on the walls. <gasps> I'm so high I can't feel anything. You can eat me now. I'm like, hmm, should I put this gun away? It's not like it's any use. <laughs> Uh, I might find some ammo at some point in the not so distant future. <laughs> anyway, that's uh, totally the end of the video. Oh yeah, oops. See you later. Bye.